karibu kwa chini king ngara ya western nyota skwelano sian shibia omyanzi kwanza nenda macheni kefu mca we wadion karia mu county ya nakuru pita palanga arusi obusirishi weshaya kumenywa be wadi ya bokoli rim konsonzi yewe amumbo atakario amenywa be nyobe ohubukula ebima yobulamu ili wanyala kunyola obusirishi oblai ni kababari wala lwala people have been infected by jikas as you may have seen yesterday and the other day and through your organization handprints we've been able to address and attend to more than 100 or 150 cases in respective camps. I want to mention here categorically that this is the fourth camp that we are receiving and having from the handprints organization. This is the fourth one. I want to really sincerely thank you for your continuous support. On behalf of this community, I wish to put a request before you that so many people have been infected by bedbugs, so many people have been infected by jikas, and some, so many people again have been infected by tropical diseases. Through your partnership and other friends, and I wish to call upon any other stakeholder, even abroad, that kindly work on how we can network with more friends, more partners to come on board so that they support us on this particular venture. On behalf of my community police members, I wish to request Tafadhali tuondoe siasa katika haya maneno. Sijaleta hii makambo hapa hao wageni kwa sababu ya kutafuta kura. Nimeleta hapa hao wageni kwa sababu niliona kazi nzuri wanaifanya kuingineko ili waji wasaidia watu wetu nyumbani. <laughs> Eselunone ngwa kumuchuli, balazi kesawa. Mungu wa mwamza kula chafe za palanga, mungu kule bawa ila. Na sinutiza nene nyoli lenje paka anderemu. Tafadhali naomba kwa ishima. Naomba kwa heshima watu waaze waondoke mambo ya siasa ili tusaidie watu wetu ambao watibiwe kwa sababu ya time i will not want to take too much by my, my brother john sina maneno ya kukushukuru lakini tafadhali naomba kwa heshima jana uliambiwa na juzi watu wetu bado kuna jikas pale kwa nyumbani ninaomba kwamba tuwe na mpangilio kufuatilia those follow up diseases hata kuko nyumbani tufanye the infection kwa hizo manyumba ili tuone kwa fumigation ili kwamba watu wasaidike as i conclude so far kuna nyumba ambayo there is a house that has been put up worth 32 iron sheets today as we are moving from here tunaenda pale chini huo mundu bali toto wa mama kugendanga unaona na buru ambayo mumanyi tunaenda hapo kujenga nyumba ya mabati 32 kupitia kwa hao wageni Kwa sababu tunaona kwamba watu wengine wanaadhirika na vunza kwa sababu ya uchavu nyumbani kwao. Tafadhali tunaposaidia mtu that is a very good thing. Na ninaomba kwamba wageni wetu muzichoke kutusaidia. Hata kama ni hii moja ama mbili mmesaidia, chikezi tuko nazo mingi. Kwa hivyo mimi nawakaribisha kama on board mtusaidie watu wetu wakipata uponyaji sifa na kwa utukufu Mungu. Mungu apewe sifa kwa sababu mtakuwa mmetenda kazi poa. Kwa hivyo akasema ningependa tukumbuke watu wa nyumbani. Kwa hivyo mwaka jana sisi tumeanza kuja hapa na kufanya medical camp. Kuna watu wengi tumwatibu funza na pia kuna watu wengi tumwatibu matibabu ya kawaida. Pia tumeanza kujenga nyumba mwaka huu, tumejenga nyumba ya kwanza leo tunajenga nyumba ya pili. Hivyo ni vizuri ama ni vibaya. Nataka kuuliza swali. Palanga amefanya vibaya ama amefanya vizuri? Na mimi nimefanya vibaya ama nimefanya vizuri? Vizuri. Mimi si mwanasiasa. Mimi si mwanasiasa, mimi ni mchungaji. Kwa hivyo niko hapa leo kuhubiri, nitawahubiria sana. Hiyo ndio kazi ya Wala wanafanya siyaza huko wafa? Lakini mimi nimekuja hapa kwa sababu ya Yesu. Sababu, hii kazi na yofanya, mimi si wafamu. Lakini na mfamu ye? Na watu, okifanya mtu kitu na mfanya mungu. Mnaelewa ye? Kwa kila ambacho tunafanya, tunawafikia wale ambao na itaji, usaidizi, upasuaji, waina yoyote. Uh, na tunawapata kuwasaidia na wanaweza kutibiwa na madaktari wapasuaji na madaktari wangazi za juu ambazo wanashirikiana na sisi katika shirika letu la Upendo Health International. Kwa hivyo uh, baadhi ya magonjwa ambayo tunashughulikia ni magonjwa kama goita. Hawalipi chochote wanatibiwa free of charge kwa sababu tunawaconsider hawana uwezo. Kando na ugonjwa la goita magonjwa mengine ambayo tunashughulikia ni watoto ambao wamepinda miguu inaitwa club foot. Watoto alizaliwa wamepinda migu, tunawapata, tunawashugulikia. Also through a corrective surgery that is called the club foot repair or club foot correction. Ezezi ma pita paranga, nganekao ngoza, 
Takitare, marabeja banyo olese, marabanda hukati ino, marabandi pila jisini ngijino, ese mba pila sandi embofu, nandi wela baya elisye chikhabiru, ndi abata sekamani, ndi basiri kekobaba, ndi bosi ba uru, kwa fukani inga sesi, barushye bushi uta inga sesi. Mimi na shukuru sana kwa au madaktari nilikuwa nimelemewa, nilikuwa ninaumia katika ugonjwa ambayo nilishugulika huku na kule kwa ajili ya uvimbe wako na si kupata mtu wa usaidizi wa karibu. Niliposikia mwito wa e, mheshimiwa Peter Palanga alipo announce ya kwamba analeta madaktari wanatusaidia, nilifurahia sana na nilipoenda pale kwa hakika nikatibiwa. Nilikuwa na uvimbe wako ambayo nikoita lakini Mungu akasaidia kupitia kwa hiyo mheshimiwa wetu nikatibiwa ninasema tu ni asante omba tu ya kwamba mheshimiwa wengine pia wakaweze kuungana na mheshimiwa wetu Palanga pita Palanga ili tukaweze kutibiwa pamoja na tutakavyotibiwa pamoja tutashukuru sana Director wa school ya primary ya Sanya ili mkonsonzi yewe yekwe Caroline Nabwire arusi omlango khubebe si okhrenjera bana ba bobule le bala funganga school mkhaya Nabwira bwa rakano mushere yo graduate kwa bana muskul ya neyo na khandi nye ya ebe busi khonya abana babo ili banyere khwele oblei amasomo ka CBC take good care of them we have taken care of them for the last nine months we are just giving you for two months only as they come back let them come back safe and sound and we have been able to nurture different talents today we have seen learners coming up with different attires made for from different materials which are locally available. We have leaves which we use for CBC. We have these waste papers which we make them important for our lessons in art and craft. So our learners are good in that. We also have the issue of music. We have learners who are very good and very talented in music. So we encourage other schools and other stakeholders to nurture talents of different learners. Kuna kitu ambacho kinaitwa kwamba mtoto ameshatengenezwa kwa na foundation. So akiwa na foundation tunaweza mpeleka popote. Ningeomba kwamba wacha mtoto aende na foundation yake Kenya amekuwa nayo. Saa zingine unaweza fikiria hapa na foundation umpeleke kwenye na mpeleka. Foundation iko strong yes, but finishing iko weak. Hautaishi kwa nyumba yenye kwa na foundation peke yake lazima ifunikwe juu. So kama kwa na foundation mzuri let the finishing be done. This year tumekuwa na grade 7 wakati tulianza mwaka kulikuwa na shauku kama private schools ta host the junior secondary and the rumors went around like a bushfire. Wakisema kwamba private schools huenda watakuwa na junior secondary. I'm here proudly saying kwamba tumekuwa na junior secondary which has been very strong and we shall have still the grade 8 under the junior secondary. So if you have a child kama kuna mtoto come next year tuletayo mtoto hapa tumukuze. Sanya school we believe in performance, we believe in excellence, that is what we talk about. The head teacher has talked here about performance and I was telling a parent, it's like we are in a wrong place. We are not competing positively. Because if you are having a mock and you find that you are having a mean score of 83 or 84, and those who follow you, they are having 53, then I think we are in a wrong place. We need to move this school somewhere else. Yeah? Because this, uh, the gap is so huge. If we are class 8, you find we are topping with a mean of 374. And those who are following us, they have a mean of 340. That gap is still too big. So it's our wish that the teachers will continue working hard. Wasiwe wagema. For those who don't know where Sanya School is, we are in Webuye, Bungoma East, Sub County. It's a nice school, a nice place to be. If you have a learner and you are stranded, 
please feel free to come to Sanya School for quality education. We are good in laying foundation. Our school is one of the best when it comes to foundation laying in Bungoma County. Thank you all and I wish you Merry Christmas and a prosperous 2024. Thank you. My name is Elgert Juma from Sanya School. And this is part of CBC. I made this, this dress from Lato, the papers of Lato Milk and the creativity comes from my teacher. Tia Pamela. I feel that my school is good. It allows us to, to model and also expertise our talents and abilities. Yes. My name is Naima Bahati from Sanya School. I'm in grade 6. For me with my dress, this is art and craft. I've made it through leaves. This is a way of conserving environment. And this is what CBC is teaching us in this what we are made for. We are nurturing our talents. My school has very educated teachers, Sanya School. In Webuye, it has very educated teachers. They teach us many things, which even we came to school, we don't know anything, but they have taught us very well. And that's all I can say about my school. It's a very good school, and I encourage other pupils to come here. I have used the knowledge I have gotten in art and craft to make a dress, to model, and I would like to encourage other pupils to come in our school since it helps us to nurture our talents. And that's Ninarudishia Halmashauri ya Sanya School. Director Madam Karo pamoja na walimu wote wa Sanya School. Nyinyi ni watu wa maana sana maishani mwetu na maishani mwa watoto wetu. Muda ule mnashinda na hawa watoto hapa shuleni ni mwingi kuliko ule muda tunashinda na watoto wetu nyumbani. Mumewalea, mumewakuza. Macheni kandi abasahulu abatachoni ba laume serikali ya kaunti na serikali ya kitaifa ukuchenja elira ya skulu ya sangalo ukubwa bungoma technical institute. Unahana nenda abasahulu bano nivongo suwa nende letia sewe kesa. Unabwala angabari elira sangalo ya rulana nende omila yom. Emila yomwana umtachoni ukuchenja elira rinero nukwino niya historia. Serikali yetu ya bungoma ya kaunti inapanga mpango ya kubadilisha jina la sangalo ati hitu Bungoma National Polytechnic kwanza tungependa kushukuru serikali kwa mpangilio wa kuinua uh, hii college iwe National Polytechnic tunawashukuru sana kwa sababu tangu iletwe hapo mwaka wa 1924 na Dr. Kemruna kishaomba eh, udongo apewe na kapewa na sudi na majanja ambaye alikuwa anatawala hapo lakini mjua ya kwamba hiyo ngome ilikuwa ya watachoni ndiyo ikaitwa hivyo kwa sababu ikiwa ilikuwa ya mtu mwingine mbona hakuita sangalo ilifungua milango yake 1931 eh, kila china la la kitu chote katika area hii yetu ya Pungoma county hata sio ni nini sangalo peke yake eh, iliwekwa na sababu fulani kwa hivyo kama tunataka tuiondoe lazima tuhusishe kila mtu akae mtuelese ni kwa nini hiyo china ina, inapatilishwa ama e, tunashita na china hii kwa sababu hii na hii lakini bila ya hiyo sisi tunaona ya kwamba e, tunaingiliwa na vile tunaingiliwa na sisi pia tutaulisa kulingana na e, mipango ya serikali pia tuone vile tunaweza kusaidiwa. Kwa hivyo sisi tumekataa, sisi tunafikiria sangalo ipaki tu sangalo. Sisi atukatai college iwe National Polytechnic. Lakini kubadilisha jina litoke kwa sangalo atiliitwe e, Bungoma tunakataa kwa sababu zifuatazo. Ya kwanza vile constitution yetu tunasema ili jambo 
county government ya Lusaka haikuweka kwa public participation ilo jambo liko kwa constitution yetu ya 2010 mbona hakutumia ya pili ikiwa hili jina sangalo linamaanisha imbanya vile nimesema ina inaonekana ya kwamba ni, in, ni jina linalenga mtachoni kwa hivyo nia ya kupadilisha jina ni kusema sasa jina la mtachoni lisisikike na tunakataa hiyo ya tatu hapo ndiyo sisi tulipanga mpango wengine wavuke ngambo waingie kakameka ya sasa na wale wengine wabaki hapa ya inne wakati unafanya mabadiliko kama haya na ujauliza watu wote unaingilia eh, desturi za jamii hiyo hizo desturi kwa nini unataka kuziondoa ya tano hii college iko na wanafunzi zaidi ya elfu kumi na mbili na wanatoka dunia nzima si hawatoki tu bongoma ama kakameka wengine wanatoka hata ngambo wako hapo hapo hata ukichukua alumni ya sangalo saa hii ni zaidi ya elfu kumi na mbili na wako wanatoka kila pahali ya dunia ukitoa jina sangalo unaharibu alumni na hiyo historia ya alumni na ya hiyo kwa hivyo lazima sangalo ibaki vile ilivyo wasiwalizlete mambo mengine tunalo katika mienendo zetu za historia mahali pale sangalo ndipo tulifanya mpango wa kutawanyika wengine waende ngambo ya mto nzoia ambao ulikuwa unaitwa kuboram ikabadilishwa na mumia ikaitwa nzoia na wengine wabaki upande wa e, kaskazini ambapo ni kuna bungoma ya, ya sasa sangalo manake ni e, pengo upande wa meno ukiwa na pengo ya juu hapana ile ya chini tunaitanga imbanya Gavana wa kaunti ya Bungoma Kenneth Makelo Lusaka arenyanga hatua ibukulua ile kwa kishombu mwana mhana shalatiranga inda na ari muskulu tawe wanahana nende gavana lusaka la walangari zaidi ya basomishir na moja mu kaunti ya Bungoma muskulu indala ba bere ne batira etsinda na bar muskulu na balala babo na bebusi ile kwa dala walangari dala kalusianga amasomo enyuma mambo ingine eh, deputy ameongelea mambo ya teenage pregnancy mimi nimeshituka leo kusikia ati kuna shule iko na watoto ishirina moja wako pregnant and 31 mothers hiyo ni shule ama what can we call that <laughs> very shocking it is true sasa inaonekana hiyo shule ile subject tunasoma ni biology peke yake <laughs> practical reproduction ndio inafundishwa kwa hiyo shule i don't want to mention it but it's a very serious thing we must take we, this is a crisis tunataka team ya education waende kwa hiyo shule to establish what is happening and the community we cannot have 21 students pregnant in a school one school and that one mothers yani wamezana wamerudi shule what is all that hatuwezi kukubali vitu kama hizo nimeuliza kama ni ukweli ama ni rumors nikaambiwa ni ukweli So next week is a crisis we have to have a crisis meeting wanaume wako tujue tuambiane hii what is the problem Kama unataka wanafunzi na unaona kuna mama ambao wanatosha tuwapatie uniform If your attraction is to uniform we give you a uniform that looks like that so that you can now prosper Lakini as account is a shame hatuwezi kukuwa na vitu kama hizo <laughs> So niwaulize pia watoto wetu wanaenda kufanya mtihani let us give them the support that they want let's give them an environment wa mepitia, wa mesoma, through difficulties this is now the time for them kwenda kufanya mtihani wafanya mtihani yao want to wish them well na wakikuja nyumbani bila viongozi wengine wamesema let us take a keen interest in our children 
ili waweze kutujue wameenda wapi ama wanafanya nini these are our own children let us nurture them otherwise we shall be eh, tutakuwa tunamaliza uzazi ujao Mkubakano wa karero hobosero nende MP wa kandui John Makari umbunge wa county ya Bungoma Catherine Wambiyanga wala wala anga wari kenya hananga hatuwe ndulu ibukuwe walia wenoni anga masomo kavana abahana Kwa mahili kisimama hili kama mama county kuna changa moja kubwa sana ya mimba za mapema Kuna chule moja kule Bungoma imekuwa na watoto wa sichana ishirini In junior secondary wamepata mimba za mapema Tusipoongea na watoto wetu kama wazazi tutaendelea kupoteza hao watoto na haitakuwa jambo nzuri. Mimi nataka kuwaomba tupeleke mtoto msichana shuleni. Tupeleke mtoto msichana shuleni. Tamaa na leo samba nenda hii. Tuhakikishe kwamba tunatoa hizi vitu za mimba za mapema za watoto wetu. Baba anana bechengo muhoje hiba andewepo chuchunge watoto wetu Kwa siweze kupata mimba za mapema Januari watoto warudi shule Habebu si bali nende abana wanyola sinda na masomi venyerwe Hakusho mbabana bena bala kalukanga iskulu Kanoka borwe nende daktari violetu wanjala Ala wala anga ari umwana umkana venende haki nyokunyola amasomo So let us focus our energies and Dad talked about early childhood, um, uh, teenage pregnancies. I want to tell you, do not be defined by that situation. The fact that you got a baby early does not mean you cannot make it in life. Please come and talk to me. That should not stop you. It happened, it happened. It passed at times does not dictate your future you watoto wenye wanapata pregnancies at a teenager stage tusiwake hao watoto shika kama wewe ni mama shika mchuku rutisha mtoto wako wapi shule asome ile na adima ina sasa hii tunapata training course ya mtoto in a polytechnic or in a college your start may have been hard I am saying these things is that Ohaukoli wa mema tulo So nyala wacha abunduta Nese mani shako ya liba nino kenda Nga vike leno cheskulu so nyala wacha abunduta So I am here to encourage everybody Don't focus on your current circumstances Look ahead and let the Lord walk that journey with you. You're doing nothing about that situation. It will not change. So you have to step out and tell yourself, me and with my God, I am going to change the situation. Nae Bishopu Wekansa Yapefa Morris Wanjala Abore Mushareo Graduata Kwadaktari Wanjala Arbolanga are abuse no boko lauma ni kabambu abana bala nyola sinda and wachiri muskulu. No abapa mulio ha. Kwa mama mulio hapa, muelewe, wakati mungu anakupariki na mtoto msichana, na huyu msichana aribu upikira wake na angali ako kwako, laana huwa inaingia. Yote alia hapa, kama ako pikira, tetea maisha yewe upikira. Kwa sababu unapo jiharibu ukiwa ungali huko kwa wazazi wako, laana inakuja juu yako. Na hiyo itaharibu maisha ya ndoa yako. Ndiyo mutaona kweli ni makosa wa mama is your responsibility kusaidia watoto wa sichana ulia nao. Na vijana nao pia wasingajie na wakijua huyo mungu hawata anza kujiharibu wa haribu wa obyo obyo. And better, but I reign state that respect must be upheld. So Kuka, we will organize if we could get a group of young professionals, and I'm ready to spearhead this, and get as many girls as possible to educate them, to support them, to mentor them. But one critical thing is that you will accept that we have our place, and there is a place for the men in the society. So we must have a balance. Let the man be educated, let the woman be educated, let's do this together. So that is what I stand for, and that is what I believe in. A watchman, Western. To get a watchman, Western. Wanduku wapendo wa baba mulio hapa. 
wa mama mlio hapa tangu tupate uhuru Pungoma county ama Pungoma district hatujawahi kupata a leader ambaye akitoka the resalegas ya kwamba amefanya watu wake mukienda kirinyaka muende embu muende mpaka kule meru ma industries ma universities soko ziko na orofa wameendelea wameendelea alafu babu busu ni aibu mungu atusaidie wakiuliza babu busu industrial park wanajua ni nini has anybody given me uh, 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 about the industrial park hata kiongozi didmas mungu ambariki huyo mheshimiwa we have never met in person but he has something nimezunguka hiyo area kwa mashule anahakikisha anajenga maorofa anasaidia maskini Macheni kandi mbunge wa Konsenzi ya Bukwa Martin Wanyonyi Pepela Arenyanga waziri we mihanda kipchumba murkomen kwa kishombo mwanda kwa msihu hosena itiri kwa lombo wangu wangu Hanende Pepela Bulangar mwanda kwa nao kubukura munda munda mrambi okumalwa Otherwise ukiwa hapa mheshimiwa murkomen waziri alisema in two months imamu ya barabara ame atakuwa ame ameana mwelekeo miezi mbili saa hizi imeisha that's why tukio hapa pia ni visi tunaambia waziri murkome ya kwamba Kenya mambo ni matatu kama hii barabara utengenezi pia uwame Kenya na kama wezi ama Kenya wende vizuri sababu hatuwezi kuwa na barabara ambayo inafanana hii and i think mheshimiwa governor we must together continue pushing to ensure that this particular role inawekwa pesa na inafanyika na inamalizika so that is what we have to say tutajaribu kuona ile tunaweza kufanya mheshimiwa mambo ya mambo ya agriculture mambo ya roads lakini ya muhimu ni hii barabara ya misihu brigadia ambayo tumeizungumzia upande yule contractor yule alileta mu chinese is a very useless fellow ame to let down We have told the national government kwamba wakikubali yule contract ambaye anafanya kutoka eh, Naitiri kwenda upande wa Brigidia aendelea amalize hii barabara because on that side we have been assured by December lami itakuwa imefika Brigidia from Naitiri na tunataka akimaliza akuja amalize this other section so that watu wa huko wache kuumia vile wamekuwa wakiumia you know we are now held up kwa sababu there's a contractor ukiweka mashini nyingine unakuwa unavunja sheria but we will try our level best kufanya iwe motorable mahali tunaweza kukupitia vile tumetangaza hii barabara lazima ikushe we are going to do supplementary next week i want to ensure that tunaweka pesa hii barabara iraidishe usafiri kwenda Tongaren mpaka kule Matunda kuna barabara ambayo inatokea Luguru inapitia Lugusi inakuja inaanguka kwa hii barabara. Hiyo pia imewekwa kwa budget kuwekwa lami ili ifungue hiyo yetu ya kibisi. Kuna barabara ya Tarbo kuja Mbakalo mpaka Zikendu mpaka Babaton kwenda mpaka kule Endebes. Hiyo pia barabara imewekwa kwa oronda ya kupigwa lami. Kwa hiyo mambo mengi itafanyika. Kiongozi wa Kuramu County ya Bungoma ni Bongosi wa Nende Senator David Wakoli Bale Nyanga Secretary General wa Shama Shayudi Cleofas Malala au Kwanza Heshima Kiongozi wa Shama cha Kod Kenya Moses Masika Watangula Kiongozi wa Nawala Bwalanga Bari Kenya Hananga Shama cha Kod Kenya Shinyore Heshima kama partner wa Kenya Kwanza Mheshimiwa William Ruto I have respect for you but mtu akipiga baba yangu na unakaa na yeye unakunywa na yeye i have a reason to question that kind of arrangement from today moving forward papa aroma allow me to be a defender and an offender on behalf of the people of bungoma and on behalf of ford kenya if we are in a coalition with kenya kwanza partners and that is uda let us respect each other 
respect our speaker, respect our party leader, respect our son of Bungoma, ili tusoge mbele kama nyumba ya Kenya. We are operating in an executive where the Secretary General of UDA anaka katika baraza la mawaziri. Yale wanapanga wanajua. Lakini akija hapa Bungoma na kukuonyesha vidole kana kwamba wewe unakaa kwa executive. I have every reason to go back to Senate and question why are they attacking you and yet you are supporting the government by passing bills, mobilizing members of parliament and ensuring development comes to the people of Bungo. So, ya kwamba sisi kiongozi wetu hapa Bungoma na nchi ya Kenya kiongozi wetu ni Moses Masika nani? Ukishika weta umeshika watu wa Bungoma. Ukishika weta umeshika investor. That's why tunaambia rafiki yetu Malala kama ni kutusi weta umetusi imetosha. You have now crossed the red line. No hiyo hiyo kumbabu fanya kwingine lakini hapa Bungoma utarudi tena. Kutusi weta. Kenya now I am the Secretary General for the Long Holy City. We need to be together in this game. I am telling you if Bungoma can get all the 45 MCS in Fort Kenya, we shall get 18 nominated. The whole world, after the size of the Muslims, the Muslims are the Muslims. 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 I'm telling you the truth. Tuko pamoja nini? Ndio leo kumera AMB, tuko karibu kabisa. Na ninyi wenyewe msirarue hiyo, msichanganye na msiharibu. Ogenyo wako moho paranya. Tano. Ogenyo wako moho mumwa ni mtabati. Tano. Ese no no ngawa azimio Hukora kiso ni sana na kwa alawa leaders maybe ama bibindi kuicha kuko ma Moses mungu mwabu Abwe na ana ala mbibu Wanda ya kakawa kame nyamuji ya bunya asumure kwa kwe Mara Moses ya ne kumwe kumusicha Kaba ne sidu mmoho na wanya wana lipa bibindi wa forike Kwa amu sabana aku Kuma amine nye kusi ime Because yoso ni chingeta Ma chinge choo Tibetanga mbu, wengi angamba kiamu. Dono hupusi alala huri. Twenty twenty seven ni kasi benyangu. Lakini le wapo kwa udiki, le wicha kumbom, ora kama Moses sita. Yangu mbele wazim. Sisi ni ya kambi ya kama beriyo. Le wapo kwenye mbuo na moja. Mi ya mi odia. But I really respect for the king. Na nyenye mmelinda hiyo nyumba sawasawa. Simba bado ina wapi? Na wapi? You know why? Because of steady leadership of Weta. Political cannibalism. Assimilation. Atu wengine wameza wengine. Port Kenya mukai pivo hivo. We ask you to stay firm. And we will put us up to mama kitete. We are brothers and sisters. This is a multi-party uh, political country, and that should be left alone. And we respect everybody. Ne no kumalira amacheni kefu. Abasomi peskulu ya bahana ya Saint Cecilia bari nyanga balombiru edometry. Kuna kanda basomi wana bari balanga bari. Bari nyanga edometry ya mabati. Ni banya umbunge wa konsensi yewe kwa Martin wanyonyo hukula hatua alani ni viongozi bandi ile kwa kishombo bananyola anga edometry ndai However the school has continuously grown to a population of 2000 students and one of the challenges we are facing as a school is the capacity of students to fit in the available dormitories 
the Board of Management has gone out of its way to build two Mabati dormitories to help me congest the congested dorms. Kindly Mweshimiwa, as you go back to the office in your county, we have one important request for you to come back and mobilize funds for the construction of a two-story dormitory to hold 500 students. As a school, we are also working hard, and our KCSE target this year is... to uphold high standards of discipline as our school motto says Discipline precedes success And I advise you my fellow students as you are going home for your holidays Can you kindly sit down and read? Have a nice, have a nice week. Thank you. And I want to tell students and Madam uh, Chief Principal here and the Board of Management that governor is not here by accident. He deliberately came here. And that demonstrates his commitment and determination in supporting this school. So we want to just assure uh, the school, we talked about uh, Mabati dormitory. <laughs> so, Madam Principal, we, when you came here, I remember when we are ushering you in, we agreed that in this budget we are going to put money in our CDF to build a dormitory. Also persuade uh, my friend uh, Mishma Gavan here uh, to help me in persuading the Speaker of the National Assembly, so that over and above what we will be allocating this financial year, the Ministry also can supplement what we have allocated, so that then we can even have a, a better, a modern, and a bigger uh, dormitory for the And I want to encourage you. As we are coming to the close of the term, most of us, we are going back home to our parents. Kindly remain disciplined. Keep the standards of St. Cecilia. Don't go out there and accept to be deceived by the young men or the old men out there. There is a bad, very bad report in our county that in one of our schools, we have more than 20 girls that are pregnant and more than 30 who are mothers. They have children, but they went back to school. Is that what we would want to hear? No. You can see our governor is a very presentable person. Now if a report is given and then they say Bungoma, what will other people think about us? Kindly, as you go home, take care of yourself. What have I say? Take care of ourselves. We are not going to be able to do it. We are not going to be able to Mivayo Neshpindi cheche sango mpira Etimbro Rekpi Nende mvayo chindi Okurula mutinguri angurya Eskwenyi nende timbaka tiosti ya mumbo Lola ingangare western nyota Vili nyanga ya jumatatu Okwanza amasaka sane Paka amasaka satano tia subui Nende isukwe jumamosi okwanza masaka saa nane paka masaka saa tisote ya nkolobe Onyore obunulubu mpira 
Eshpindi shok muito mie, neshpindi shukureranga amerwato, okurla kubakambi ba mumbo mwa Kenya. Okakosa okulola amerwato, kalaonia omoyo kukuo, kuingangara ya western yota, huri siku ya jumatatu, okula siku ya jumapili. Okuanzira sa kumnambili asubui, okula sa moja asubui. Ne siku ya jumamosi amerwato, kala kuitira kuanzira sa moja asubui, okula sa mbili asubui. Western Nyota TV ano nyo Incredible Western Ji ni jipindi shamekiso kibiashara mutsingongo shilomolomera butamu umumbo mwiru mwa Kenya Jipindi shi shimanyinywa kongere ya wayanza ya Western Nyota TV kuchaka amukoloba masaka sa 11 kutoka masaka sa 12 buli nyanga Londe la Karibu huko machini keng ngara ya Western Nyota Square Lano Asian Shibia Omianzi. Kwanza nenda machini kefu MCA we Wadiol Karia mu county ya Nakuru Peter Palanga. Arusi obusirishi we shaya kumenywa we wadi ya Bokoli ya Mkonsenzi ya we Amumbo. Atakario abmenywa we nyobe okubukula ebima ya bulamu ili wanyala kunyola obusirishi obulai ni kababari wala luala. People have been infected by jikas as you may have seen yesterday and the other day and through your organization handprints we've been able to address and attend to more than 100 or 150 cases in respective camps i want to mention here categorically that this is the fourth camp that we are receiving and having from the handprints organization this is the fourth one i want to really sincerely thank you for your continuous support